Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Happy 2019. I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday and a happy new year. I know it's like 10 days into the new year, but I definitely enjoyed myself this holiday season. I had family in town and just got to spend really good quality time with everybody. I'm still trying to get over this cough that will not leave me alone. So if I sound a little sick, that is why I had a cold before Christmas and the cough has just lingered on and on and on and won't go away. But anyway, before I started with the makeup videos, the reviews and things like that, things that I wanna bring to my channel, I decided that I wanted to share with you like the goals that I have for this year, the things that I kinda wanna change within myself and a few quotes that I actually want to kind of, I guess, live by. Excuse my nails. I'm gonna go get them done either today or tomorrow. I've been due for a fill for like the past week. They look really bad, but yeah, totally distracted. Um, just wanted to share with you guys like just some changes that I wanted to make um, for the new year, for my channel, for myself. This is more for me than anything, just because I want to be able to look back at what I said I was gonna do, what my goals were for the year, and then at the end of the year I can look and see, hey, did you accomplish this? Why didn't you? What? Why did you? What steps did you take to actually reach your goals? Things like that. So this is more for me, but if this helps you guys, if it helps anybody, then that's definitely a plus. This year I decided that instead of setting New Year's resolutions, I wanted to focus on things that were going to make me a better person, things that I wanted to improve on. I'm gonna go through these fairly quickly because I feel like they're pretty self-explanatory. So I'm just gonna start with the first one that I have here, which is to be closer to God. I really feel like I need to strengthen my relationship with God. I feel like I need to start going to church because I don't go, I haven't gone in a really long time. And I wanna pray more. I, I wanna pray more than I do. I definitely do pray, but it's not, it's not as much as I would like to. Another one is to be productive. I feel like last year, was a very slow year for me. Uh, I wasn't as productive as I would have liked. I wasn't very active on my channel, on my social media. Um, I didn't put as much effort into my business as I probably should. And I wanna do that this year. I wanna be more consistent with my channel. I wanna be more consistent with posting on social media, with interacting with my audience, getting things done around the house early in the morning instead of putting everything off to one day, just stuff like that. Like I just wanna be more productive and and just do better this year. Another one is to be healthy. Um, I have gained more weight than I would like to. Um, I, I'm pretty sure that I'm overweight for my height, for my age. I'm starting to take the steps to be a healthier person. Um, I've started the keto diet and I'm going to be incorporating exercise next week. I am trying to drink a lot more water. That's pretty much all I drink. So I've cut out sugar and carbs. So no more juices, no more sodas. Um, very, very, very little alcohol, which is okay with me. I'm also um, documenting all of that. So if you're interested in my journey, my weight loss journey, because I'm starting it over for like the hundredth time. I'm gonna be uploading videos on that probably only once a month. Those are the type of videos that I will be adding to my channel as well. So if you are interested, make sure you look out for those. Another one of my goals is to be happy. And this one is pretty self-explanatory. Like I said, I just, I wanna be happy. I know that there's gonna be days that I'm not gonna feel very good. I'm gonna feel sad angry, you know, there's gonna be situations that are just gonna change my mood, but I wanted to change my mood temporarily, just for the moment, and then I wanna be happy again. And that is all gonna depend on me. I'm the only one that can decide if I wanna be happy or not, so that is completely 100% up to me, and yeah, I just, I really, I just wanna be happy. Another goal of mine is to be positive, Again, there's gonna be situations where I'm not gonna feel the greatest and I'm gonna wanna go into negative Nancy mode and 
I don't want to do that. I want to be able to be positive about any situation and just kind of see the light at the end of the tunnel and take every experience as a positive experience, whether it's, you know, something bad. It's a learning experience, which makes it something positive because I learned something. Um, basically, I just want to be a positive person. I want to have good energy. I want to put out good energy. Last thing that I have written down here as far as something that I want to focus on is to be myself. I don't want to ever lose myself to anything or anyone. I want to always remain the person that I am now. Um, obviously, I want to grow and I want to be better, but I don't ever want to lose who I am deep down inside. Always true to myself. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Aside from the things that I want to be better at and focus on for the year, there's a few quotes that I looked up that are kind of, for me, going to be quotes that I want to live by. And so the first one is to start each day with a grateful heart. I want to wake up every morning and be thankful for everything, for everything that I have, for the people in my life, for seeing a new day, for having food on the table, a roof over my head, a family, my friends, a husband that loves me, a daughter that is so good that hasn't caused me any problems. Like, I just want to be thankful and feel grateful and not just feel it in here, but also vocalize it. Like, I need to say it. The second one I have written down is, it's never too late to get your shit together. For me, this one is a big one because I'm, unfortunately, and I hate to say this, but I've come to the realization that I start a lot of things and I don't finish them. I kind of just put them off to the side and I leave them there. And then I start something else and I don't finish that and I start something else. What I'm trying to say is that it's never too late to do that. So like if you started school and you didn't finish, it's okay. It's not too late to go back. Go back to school. If you, you know, used to go to the gym and now you don't, go back to the gym. It's not too late. It's going to take work, but it's not too late to get it together. Like you can do it. Another one of the quotes is you get what you work for, not what you wish for. Which to me, this just means if you want something, you have to work for it. You've got to put in work. You're not going to be handed on a silver platter what you're asking for. And it's not going to come to you if you're just sitting on your couch hoping and wishing for it. You got to work for it. You got to work for your goals. Nobody else is going to work for what you want in life harder than you are. Yeah, there's going to be people that support you and you're going to have, you know, people that encourage you and motivate you. But Ultimately, you still have to do it. You still have to get up and do the work. It's not gonna come to you or fall out of the sky. You gotta put in work. And then the last one that I have written down is you can't change the direction of the wind, but you can adjust your sails. To me, that just means don't worry about what other people are doing, what other people are saying. Um, don't let people put you in a mood. Don't let people ruin your day. You've got to be able to control the way you react to certain situations. You can't blame anybody else for having a bad day. You can't blame anybody for, you know, screwing up or not doing this or feeling a certain way. Like, you can't do that. I mean, you've got to take responsibility for your own actions, for your own feelings and all that. So you can't blame other people for your actions and things like that. So that's what I want to focus on for this year. And I just want to work on being a better person, being a better wife, a better mother, a better daughter, a better sister, a better friend. Like I, I really want to focus on improvement this year and just being better, always being better. So that is it, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments below what your New Year's resolutions are, if you have any goals for 2019. Maybe I can add some of those to mine. I'm really interested to see what you guys are working towards for the new year. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe on your way out if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video.